We are Kentucky Humanities, and we love books. Books, books, books. We love people who love books. We love the writers and illustrators and agents and publishers who also love the people who love books. The 41st Annual Kentucky Humanities Kentucky Book Festival brought together writers and readers to promote and celebrate books, reading, literacy, and the craft of writing. And thousands of people came from all over the region to buy books from their favorite authors. Hundreds heard author and scholar John Meacham and professor and historian David Blight discuss Meacham's newest book on Abraham Lincoln which sounded at times like a cross between a highly skilled, spirited debate on democracy and a segment from Saturday Night Live. Uh, uh, he said that. I, <laughs> I had four jobs at Yale. And they, all, they all followed me here, but go ahead. An afternoon session brought 300-plus book lovers to the literary landing for Barbara Kingsolver's discussion of her new elegant novel, Demon Copperhead. Wendell Berry and Crystal Wilkinson were this year's opening act as hundreds packed the University of Kentucky main stage for a glance at perhaps Kentucky's most masterful and beloved writer of all time. The Barry signing line alone stretched throughout the store. Pulitzer Prize winning novelist Geraldine Brooks was a crowd favorite, selling out the literary lunch on Thursday for the first time and drawing a big crowd for her state appearance on Saturday with Frank X. Walker. Outside in the children's tent, more families and kiddos than ever before filled the tent to buy a book, listen to story time, have their face painted, or pick up a voucher for a free book for those 12 and under. In total, we raised enough money to give away nearly 300 books. A very successful 2022 Kentucky Book Festival.